What's up everybody, Awful Awful Games here, and today I'm playing some more Planet Zoo. Now, while I'm starting this up, uh, I made a video yesterday, but the recording didn't properly save, so you guys have missed out on a bunch of some good work on this first zoo. I have gotten two habitats in with uh, some peacocks and warthogs. I'm making a good $10,000 a year and have fairly good really everything right now. It's not the best looking, but I'm doing work on that. Right now I'm just trying to maintain a profit. I'll give a tour once this loads up. But while this is loading, make sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell icon down below, and we'll get right into it here. So this is the first, like, area so far. Haven't done a whole lot. There's the back area back here. I've got the peacocks. This needs to be checked up on. Mechanic is in route. Oh, he's working on it right now. Alright, good. Mm -hmm. This over here is looking fine. Let's see. Call a mechanic. I need a mechanic to come and get this. Maintenance. Uh, mechanics should be every month. Where is the mechanic at, though? That is the question. I'm gonna cancel that and hire another mechanic. I think I have one. I'll see in just a second. Let's see, staff mechanics. So yeah, I only got one. I'm gonna hire another. I'm gonna keep it to a minimum, though because payment purposes. Now let's see. Zoo profits. I've made $5,000 right now and I'm still going up in money. I make about $8,000 average every year. So now I'm going to call a mechanic to this habitat. Call a mechanic. Mechanic and route. There he is. Right there. Alright, that's good. Uh, I think the first thing I'm going to do in this episode is start decorating. Here's the, uh, warthogs. I've got a nice little area in here. And then over here's the pea fowls. They've had a couple of babies. Right there. So, I'm going to expand this out this direction. It's probably going to wrap around. And let's see how many. Oh. Alright, like 2,000, around 2,000 in that other box. How about over here? 2,400. Gaining some money off of those. So let's see. Am I still making money though? It looks like I am. Yeah, I am for sure. I'm most definitely still making money. That's good to know. Let's get some more paths. It's gonna wrap around. Expand out this way. Stop there. Just don't want to spend too much money. Let's see, I have another player visiting. Ah, he just left. Event uh, research is complete. Let's get that good. Continue. Do I have anything inside of the veterinary animals? None. Nope. As of right now, I'm all good. Alright, good. So, I'm gonna continue over here and make another little uh, habitat. First, I need to see what animal I should do for it. I'm gonna try to keep it cheap at the beginning. Uh, you start with $4,000 in franchise mode. Just... 
everybody should know that. If you guys are new to the game, then that's how much you start with in franchise mode. I, I haven't played career mode yet, so I don't know how much you start with in career mode. Let's do some timber wolves. Timber wolves. Sure. Alright, let's get some nice timber wolves in here. Let's see their genes. I'd like to keep them in the yellow or the green. Ooh! Ah, no, I don't have enough to do that. Not yet. Let's try to get the best one I can find in here. That one's okay. Doesn't need to be too fertile. Get that success. VIP guest is arriving at my zoo. Don't know who that is. And this one looks pretty good too. Alright, there we go. I'll just start with two. Uh, animal storage. Wait, let's see. I have it. the cause of... Oh, that fixed it. Alright. All good there. Let's see who this is and what they think about it. Nah, I'm fine. Alright, so... I'm gonna find... Here, just some barriers right now. They're gonna need a nice Arctic style barrier. I'm gonna do. Wait, what do they need resistance wise? Uh, I think you can see it in Zoopedia. Let's see. Timberwolf. What do you need? Uh, grade 2 to 4. Or right, grade 2. Four feet, so two meters will be just fine. Let's see height. It's already at two meters, so that'll be good. We'll get that start built up. So let's see. I'm gonna have them in this area over here. doesn't have to be too big. Don't want to spend too much money. Increase that length. Increase that over to here. Replace this with glass. Good. That's gonna be the rough size inspector arriving. I'm gonna. This is all good. Continue. Ooh, African theme. That's really good. Now we have the uh, African theme. So when I have a uh, different section, that'll be nice. Continue. It's all good. Now let's get this began. I know they're gonna need a lot of stone. They're gonna need some snow. I'm probably gonna have to decrease the temperature for them using the uh, coolers. So let's see. Let's just get a couple. I know they're gonna need hard shelter, so I might as well make a cave. Uh, let's see. That'll be a good enough size. looking hill here that'll lead into a cave. Something like that. 
smooth out the edges. Make this back a little bit. More like that. Any babies or adults that I can sell, I will. I'll quick trade them or release them to the wild for some quick cash. Because I don't want to have too many and if I can get rid of them. So that people have the chance to use others or oh. Diseased animal discovered vet called vet called. Alright, good. Let's see how many are in there. We'll get two in there it looks like. Get the other one in. There we go, he's getting him. Alright, there we go. They'll get healed. They'll get fixed up. That's all good. That looks actually pretty nice. I like the way this looked out. Or turned out, I guess. I'm at 50,000. See, am I still making some cash? Yes, I am. That's good. Cash flow income. Huh, actually, I'm doing real nine. Or nine? Real nice. I'm not r er, German. I am not. I am. N I'm not German. <laughs> I'm doing real nine. That's down there, I'll get him some bedding. And I'll make this look nice with some rocks. Let's see, Timberwolf. Species Timberwolf. No, I went too far, didn't I? No, I didn't. Hmm. Timberwolf. S some large bedding down there. works out. I'll get this smoothed out because that messed up the terrain a little bit. That looks a bit nicer. Oop, wrong direction. There we go. We got a little cave there. I'll get some rocks over there. Should I use ice rocks? No. That's a bit too much. Here, how about just some regular? No. Don't want tropical rock. I think I do need Taiga. Taiga rock. Let's see, can I rotate this? Wrong direction. Z. I'm gonna have to do some advanced rotating. Here we are, here we are. There we go. That looks fine. Just getting I'm gonna get a rock up here too. Just some nice highlights. Alright, tiger rock. That's nice and big. I'll get that rotated and push back a little bit. Wrong type of move. There we go. Just something like that. Works. Really nicely. There we go. That works. I'll get them their feeder because I know they'll need food. Water. Water bowl large. Yeah, I can do with a water pipe. Costs a bit more, but it works just fine. Food tray. Large. 
Let's get that a bit closer to the glass so the guests can get a nice view of it. That looks really good. Alright, now let's get them moved in. I need some access paths. Here we go, here we go. I'm gonna get rid of this and I might as well just just take it from the uh, regular old path here. No, oh, that's wrong. I need to make this a little bit longer than if that's not working. That's more like what I needed. Now let's get that door in right about there. And get the paths up and connected. Now, the Spectre has arrived at the zoo. We're at. Oh, there's the inspector. Let's see what this person looks like. Uh, eh, kind of looks like police. Except not really. Yeah, it looks like an, inspe an inspector. That's nice detail. They actually changed the uh, skin of the person that these the inspector. So let's get the habitat trading. Let's get these timber wolves moved over to this habitat. Let's see the other. Move to here. There we go. They are both being moved. see them right there. This should be nice for them. Nice cave. Eventually I might have a viewing platform coming around and down there. I'm not sure about that though. I think it's a bit too shallow to do that. One thing I am planning to do is to... I don't like that. Hold on. just a little bit annoying. There we go. Now let's see what they need. I know it's gonna have to be cooler. Whoa. I know it's really gonna have to be... It might not have to be cooler. Let's see, they don't have enrichment. Habitat looks fine. Terrain. Yeah. No, they need more? Hard shelter? I guess I could just expand it underground. Way less long grass. They can do it some more soil rock. A bit of sand. How about temperature? Temperature. It, that needs to be... No preferences for swimming. That's fine. Habitat. Hard shelter needs to be more. Plants are fine. I mean, they could do it some more. See, it's just a zero and they can go all the way. Are you guys fighting? No, it doesn't look like it. I do want to see what they think of their habitat. Is there... They could still do some more hard shelter. That's probably because they had babies. I can do that. I'm just gonna get another one of these. With most of these habitats in the early stages, I'm not going to be building hard shelter for them. I'm just going to be giving them some. How's that for you? If it's even in the green. Yeah, it's good. 100%. Let's 
let's see what. So yeah, they need their hard shelter down here expanded. Let's see terrain. Let's get that pushed back. What? No. Undo that right now. Oh, it's because I made the size so big. Still far too big. Let's be a little bit bigger. That seems about perfect. How's that hard shelter for you now? Alright, so 60. Let's see if that'll go up the more I push this back. does. They need a lot of hard shelter though. Quite a lot. So I'm gonna try to keep it, no, undo. You know, now Is that not considered hard shelter anymore? I might just get some regular hard shelter farther in the back where nobody can see it without any padding or bedding. To inbreed. No, I don't want that. Move you to here. Are you a male or a female? He's a male. Let's see, is anybody in there? Yes, he is. I'm gonna quick sell, quick trade. Confirm. Just wanna keep the species population a little bit farther down. Are you guys a male and a female? Male, female, alright, good. That's good. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna get him a bit of hard shelter farther in the back where no one can see it. So, fine. Now how's your hard shelter? That should have pushed it up, yeah, to 100%. They have a cave, I'll get them some plants. Alright, first, I am going to paint this. I need to click on you so I can see what you need. Rain paint. Yeah, way less long grass. You can do with a little bit more short grass. You can do with some more rock. Uh, you can do some more soil. You do not need long grass, though. That's one thing I know. You need to try to reduce that to just about as low as it can go. It's already at 50%. It just needs to go all the way down to nothing. Absolutely zero long grass. Come 
on. I can't get rid of anything else. What do you want me to do? Soil's pushing it to the limit. I can do some more rock now. Where else is the long grass? I don't see any long grass. I mean, besides some here. Just about it. Is it just this green? I think it is. Not much I can do about that, though. There yeah, really is not much. I can do about that. Hmm. I don't see any more long grass, so I think I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'm gonna replace some with some soil. Do it a little bit more. That's all good. You don't really need anything else. I'd like to see environment. You can do some coverage, so I'll get some... Let's see, biome... Taiga. Where's that litter at? It's all over here. I need some trash cans over in this area. Right, I can do that. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see. Bins right here. And some regular plant is recycling. And some planet zoo. There. Expecting offspring. Let's see. Visiting player. Comments of litter. Mechanic research is complete. some workers assigned to this habitat. I know that. I'll get that done in just a second. I'll just add it to the work zone and that'll fix it. So let's see, let's see nature. A taiga. There we go. I'll get him some broken pines. Black spruce pine. moss up on the rock. They might be able to lay down in that. Not really sure. It's a Christmas tree. I don't want that. No. That's festive spruce. That's why. Let's see. Oh. Oh, jeez. Look at that. That's a big cedar tree. I don't think that's quite necessary. Oops, got some pine back here. Pine there. Get him some plant. some smaller stuff around the base of the trees, stuff like that. That looks like that's good. Now let's see what they think of it. They need enrichment, that's really it. 
they need less long grass. There's nothing I can do about that, though. That is the problem. Alright, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna assign this to a work group. Zoom staff work zones. Edit work zone. You are going to be the last habitat within this work zone. The very last habitat. So that is going to be the last habitat within that work zone. I'm gonna get him. So oh, I'm at sixty-two thousand dollars. I have not been paying attention to the rise in, well, everything really. It's been going up really fast. Surprisingly, get an educational or educational. Undo, undo, undo. Just one, please. Just one. <laughs> <laughs> I placed in like three speakers. Oh, it needs to be powered. I can put some power back here and get that extended off. So that it's not showing to the guests. Alright, let's get that talking about the timber wolf. And then I'll get it power that it needs. First. I want to see before I do anything else what my staff think. He's one. No, no, this one's a bit tired. The rest of them are all happy though. Like they are under or overworked, I guess. I need another keeper and another caretaker. That's something that I do really need. Hopefully, it won't decrease my payment. Oh wow, I got a lot of money last year. A lot more than what I'm ever used to. Alright, let's see. Uh, yeah, I need to get a, another, what was it? Caretaker and keeper. It's gonna decrease the amount of money I make a little bit. Hopefully not too much. Keeper. Hi. Welcome. Caretaker. That's a little weird. There's the litter. There are trash cans here. Use the litter. Use the trash cans. I think I should probably get one over here. Alright, there we go. Oops. Player's still visiting. And clean up after yourselves, people. It's not that big of a gap. Come on. I'll get a caretaker on it. But let's see. What was I gonna do? Yes, yeah, so I was hiring another keeper. It's about to mature. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Got two caretakers. I need one more keeper. Here we go, what's doing this? Oh, that's pretty nice. making money, right? Let's see. Looks like I am. And my average per year has gone up. Spectre arriving in four months. Ooh. Yeah, I gotta call a mechanic on that. Now let's see. Every month. Every three months, 
and every three months. You know, I should probably do a keeper every month. Probably. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Mm -hmm. Same thing here. Alright, there we go. Got another room closure up. That's looking nice. How are your guys' hard shelter looking? Still a hundred percent. They need a bit more enrichment. He's hungry. Hmm. I'm gonna sell some of these bait or actually this one. Goodbye. to the wild for a bit of points. And then I'm gonna do that the same thing with a lot of these older ones and then I'll get a couple of younger peepals in. How's their social doing? Adult population could be a bit higher. I'll get a new peepal and introduce it and then get rid of a couple of the baby peepals. With some habitat trading, let's see. Species. Let's get a new peep out. Indian pea fowls. Let's get a couple more of these. Let's get a new one. Uh, with decent genes, probably female. There we go. That one looks fine. Let's move it into here. Me is visiting and another person is as well. And I'll get a couple of these younger ones. Storage and trade center. Storage and trade center. And then I'll sell them. And then I guess I'll wait for them to grow. Community gene is nice. It's gonna be a smaller one. They should be fine. How much money have I raised? Six hundred dollars, roughly. I've gotten a nice amount of money from these. They are eating. Looks like they're not super hungry right now. They've got water over here. This one's sleeping on the suspended little area over here. Some habitat. You can't really go down here, but it counts as your hard shelter, so I'll take it. Though I do think I'm gonna make it so you can. There we go, and I'll get this painted over with some rock. There we 
go. They need enrichment. I need to start getting these guys studied. Let's see, vet center. Wait, no, I want to do research. Go to vet center. Here we go. I'm going to get him on here. Now they'll be researched, and I'll get some enrichment for them. This is looking nice so far. I'm gonna start hiding some of this back area. I'm gonna get some plants back over here. Some plants around these. In between these and around curves like this. I'll do that right now. I've got enough money to spare as of right now, so... I'm gonna go with the tropical. I'd like to keep it tropical because I just really like the way that theme whole or that whole theme looks. like that makes the zoo look really nice. <laughs> Just some simple stuff like that. As you're walking by. Doesn't leave a lot of empty, unused space. Doesn't cost a lot either. In fact, I've actually gained money since the last, like, since I last checked, I've actually gained a bit of money. These things look really nice. I'll get one there. Get another, like, right here. Oh, wow, that's big. That's more like it. Some bigger stuff, some smaller stuff, all of it looks. then another thing I'll probably do, I'm gonna just refine this whole sector of the zoo real fast. What I'll do is I'll line these places with plants and then I'll get some wooden walls going all the way behind the plants to make it look nice. Yeah, that's what I'll do. 
and if anything, that'll just act as a second barrier in case something escapes. I'm probably gonna do that off camera. I'm gonna get some more of these plants put in before I end the video. No, stop inbreeding. That's not good for you. It's not, right? Well, I mean, only thing it does is decrease their genetics a little bit. Mm. I mean, they... It, you know what? I'm just gonna say it gives it a bit of spice. Randomizes it a bit. I'll deal with it. If anything bad happens, I'll just buy some new ones. Right now, it doesn't change anything. People are, they're running into these leaves. I'll back that up a little bit. They'll still get a face full of branches, but it'll look a bit nicer. It won't look like you're phasing through anything. I'm going to be decorating a building or something like that. That is a tall tree. I don't need that. I'll get a tree fern. Go back up towards the top. Get a fox tail. Nope, that's wrong. That's in the middle of the path. Basically the top, I'll get a coconut palm. Give some variation. Fill in the gap. Right now that looks nice. Yeah, just doing stuff like this makes the zoo a whole lot more refined. Oh, Warhog is gonna have offspring again. This. Welcome to have the nations. <laughs> 72,000. Wow. It's actually like this zoo. It's working. You know, I never expected for it to be that successful. I mean, I'm constantly spending money, but I'm also constantly making money. Just trying to close the gap till there. 
I'll get some bamboo further in the back. Just to cover up the back areas. Center. Mangrove apple tree. Diseased animals. It's those same two animals again. Huh. Don't know what I'm gonna do about that. It looks like. If anything, if they die, I'll just, again, get something new. I've clearly got enough money to do so. So I'm not super worried about it. show you guys what I mean by having a uh, wall going around it. And then I'm going to end this video off. So I'm just going to get some standard like wooden log barrier. It's going to be shorter. Obviously. there and just kind of wrapping around. Around all of these plants. And then connecting up to the different enclosures. So a final look would look something like that. So as you're walking by. We'll have all the nice plants. Come on, this needs to be cleaned out. Come on. Doesn't look like. The, where is the keeper even at? One disease animal left. Mechanic research complete. But yeah, it'll look just like that. A wall going around, making sure that you can't see too far in the other direction. It'll keep everybody centered and focused into the zoo. So, I'm gonna end off the episode here, and I'm gonna keep my fingers crossed that it will, hopefully, hopefully, record properly this time. And I'll see all of you guys next time. See ya.